So we've talked a lot um, tonight about the, the kind of very long term, but I'd love to get you thinking about the next 10 years with DeepMind. Hmm. Um, what do you hope that will happen in those 10 years for the company? Yeah, so my big hope, and I think we're just approaching the point where we're going to be able to start doing this, is applying um, all these learning techniques we're building, uh, learning algorithms, uh, to science itself. Mm. So actually sort of, you know, we use the scientific method to create these algorithms, but actually uh, then reapplying them back into other domains of science, like, you know, quantum chemistry or protein folding or this whole bunch of areas we're looking at. And to, you know, what I'm really looking forward to is the first big breakthrough that comes in a really hard area of science that makes a huge difference uh, you know, to the scientific or, or, or medical community that was um, in a large part helped by you know, an AI tool uh, in tandem being used by experts in those, in those areas. Mm. So I think in the next 10 years, we're gonna start seeing, you know, my hope would be in the, you know, a couple of years from now, we're gonna start seeing that happen. And then by 10 years, maybe it's gonna be quite routine, mm. um, which I think is gonna be unbelievably <laughs> revolutionary if that, if that can happen.